All right, guys. So, back at it again. Um, I'm at my folks' place in Texas. So we're gonna go out here. I say we're. I don't know why I'm saying we're. It's just me. Um, we'll go out here to the HOA pond. Um, I fished these ponds back in high school. I've done a little dangling here before. Uh, got a little chatterbait tied on. Figure I'll just go out there see what see what the dangles up to. Um, there's usually fish in these ponds. They're little micro guys. You know what I'm saying? Um, but they're still fun to catch if they're biting. Uh, so we're gonna head on down to the pond, see if anybody's down there. Last time I was here, there was like five or six people down there. Sorry, kind of hard to vlog and you know run a run a stick shift at the same time. <laughs> but I'm doing my best. So we're gonna head on down to these ponds, see if we can catch the fish. Uh, I'll pick you back up whenever. I get on the GoPro and we'll go from there. Thanks for watching guys. Stay tuned. Much moss. You need them chattering. No. Alright, guys and gals. So, that one didn't work out too well. There was no fish there. There's fish in there, they're just not biting. So, we are going on to pond number two. See if we can. Uh, Snag us some fish. I get to fish these ponds like once a month, something like that. Come down here to Texas for three days. We are headed to the next pond. Like I said, it's kind of a pain in the butt to drop stick shift. And talk to you guys. I know you hear my seatbelt thing going off. It's no big deal. I'm in a subdivision. It's cool. I promise when I get out on the open road, I go ahead and put that old seatbelt on. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. But, these guys are still at this pond. Matter of fact, dad gum it, there's more people. Shoot. Oh well, we'll try it anyway. Maybe they ain't catching nothing. Maybe I can throw that old chatter bait out there and entice somebody. Or maybe, they, oh there's some, there's just some people walking, so maybe they just brought their dog down. That's a possibility. So, we'll go up here flip you you get on this pond I'll like I said I'll, I'll switch back over to the GoPro here in a minute that way you guys can see what action I'm seeing and what I'm or what I'm not seeing according to the last pond so we will we will check it out whoa if this dude don't hit me driving all out of control and whatnot I'm not paying no attention thinking he's driving a land rover and just take all the road that he wants but all right guys well as I'm talking mess, I'm sitting here talking to the camera while I'm driving. So, all right, well, we'll sign off here, switch over to the GoPro. S stay tuned because hopefully this spot is going to be the juice. No, no, hold on, it went through. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Cornerstone on demand likes what we see. Let's talk. Ooh. Whoop, whoop. We got a code interview. I mean, I got to call back, but... Yeah. I wish it didn't say poor connection because I'm running the GoPro right now. You know, trying to catch you on a little video. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> everybody's going to... Eh? Everybody's going to think it's going to be, like, hiding yourself because it says poor connection. Do what? Are you excited? Yeah, I'm really excited. Hopefully you get it. I'm going to go do the dangle and then I'll, I'll call you back. Okay. All right, love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Sorry guys. I had to talk to my wife. Since she's still in Oklahoma. If you're wondering what that's all about, she put in for a new job. 
that pays a lot more money. Oh, hey, somebody left. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, they friendly fellow. Waving at me and such. Probably making fun of me as he drive by while I'm running my GoPro right here. You know, everybody asks me, is it really needed to buy an expensive rod? Yes. This is a Walmart rod and I can feel nothing on it. Little dink. Hmm. Something happened to his back. Bye, Carlos. the tail of that rage he didn't actually grab the whole thing he better ripped it out of his mouth I think. Be turning guy. Sweet little bass. Lacey, have a good swim. Choked that Sanko. Oh, there was a worm attached to that. Oh, 
that shit down there, right? Hi, Hillary. Hey guys, we're back in the car, as you can tell. Um, just about wasn't exactly the juice, but we caught three or four fish. Um, wasn't too bad, there were some other guys out there. I really like it whenever I see a, see a guy out there and he has his kids and his kids are having a good time, they were catching some fish. But uh, I'll probably fish these same ponds, see if there's anything different, see if I might change it up. I didn't throw the wacky rig at the other one, but I threw it at this one, caught a fish on it, had a couple bites. Uh, but they're all dink fish. So make sure you go check out Ducks Waterfowl. Doesn't support my channel, supports other people though, and we want to keep seeing them do what they do. So check out the shirt of the month. I get it every month. This isn't one of the shirts of the month. This was actually to support Nebraska during their flooding. So um, get on there, check out their gear. They got some really cool shirts. So thanks for watching, guys.